This is the women we love. Yeah. You gotta protect them. Well, that's why we're not gonna let anything happen to them or our children. You got that right. Go. Hit me. It looks like a storm's brewing. We better get inside. Yeah, you know how these spring storms blow in? I don't think this is a storm. I think this is a sign of terrible things to come. Teresa? What? Oh my god. Beth. Antonio. Sure. Sure, what's wrong? It's a sign. Look. Uh, did you do all this for Sharon? It looks so wonderful. No, no. <laughs> Ethan did it for Gwen. You know what? It, lo it looks great. Yeah. Well, um, what are you two doing here? Oh, uh, Sheridan wanted to go for a walk, and well, I didn't want to let her go alone. You know, not now that this woman's trying to kill her. And we we ran into Ethan and Gwen. Yeah. You know what? I'm really glad you were with her. I was really concerned about Sheridan when she wasn't at the cottage. I'm fine, Antonio. You know, everybody should have a brother like you, Luis. Except uh, you should let me worry about my wife. You know, you've got your own future wife and baby to worry about now. Yep. <laughs> um, Luis, I made you some homemade bread. Wow, thanks. <laughs> That's really sweet of you. How are you feeling? Um, my morning sickness comes and goes, but I'm just fine. Good. Yeah. <laughs> Luis, I'm sorry I just showed up hmm. like this, but I really needed to see you and Hank offered to drop me by. Hank, where is he? Um, parking the car. He'll be here in a sec. Well, so you said you needed to see me. Is everything all right with the baby? Lying to Luis, making him believe that you are pregnant with his baby when you are not. What kind of person does that, Bethy? A uh, smart one? An evil person, that's who. It's so sweet of you to worry, Louise, but the baby's just fine. Oh. Hey, everyone. Hey. Hank. Hey. Thanks for bringing Beth by. No problem. Uh, the station's been calling my cell phone. They're looking for you, but your phone's turned off. Oh, damn it. Totally forgot. Did they say what they wanted? Did they find that one who was trying to kill Sheridan? No, it's nothing like that. It's just they needed to fill out some paperwork for a trial today. I better go check in. Beth, have some of the food. You're eating for two now. I'm in. All right. You okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Go play. I I'll be okay. Luis, you okay? Yeah, I'm trying to be. It's just that if Sheridan and I don't tell Antonio the truth, we're going to be separated forever. Why don't you tell him? He's perfectly healthy now. The shock of knowing that you and Sheridan are in love won't kill him. Hank, I am ready to tell him. I've been ready to tell him. It's just that Sheridan can't bring herself to hurt Antonio, and well, the stress is really taking its toll on her and the baby. Yeah, I can see that. Even a trip to the circus would be a strain on you two. Yeah, no doubt. Especially now that Sheridan's got this crazy fear of clowns. She's been having nightmares and visions. It's totally freaking her out. Hey, Hank, Luis, come on. Yeah, let's play some football. Come yeah, on. that's right. Let's go. Mm -hmm. 